This newspaper article from Voz de Fatima portrayed above, indicates that the meeting and conversation between Paul VI and Sister Lucy only lasted for three minutes. The first article portrayed, I discovered in the book by Father Luigi Villa entitled Paul VI Beatified. It tells of the woman we now know as Sister Lucy II asking Paul VI for a private meeting, if he believed she was the real Sister Lucy don't you think he would be interested in what she had to say, a new apparition, perhaps? To this request the newspaper above cites him as responding, as you can see, this is not the moment, I have not gotten all the publicity yet that is my due. If you wish then to convey something to me, tell it to your bishop and he will convey it to me. Put great trust in your bishop. Be obedient to him. What did the newly minted Sister Lucy intend to convey to Paul VI? That she did not feel right about the illegal impersonation that she was now taking up? But, for Paul VI, how awkward would it have been to meet with someone you know to be a fraud? Be obedient. Take up the role that we have bestowed upon you and if you have any qualms of conscience or personal difficulties, go cry to the bishop. Another of the many strange things surrounding this 1967 meeting, amidst the general strangeness of the entire Sister Lucy Dos Santos case, is the obviously faked pictures of her in Fatima, with Paul VI. Obviously they could not have been near each other for very long since so many pictures have clearly been faked. What we can see in the first picture presented in the Father Villa book is a Sister Lucy who never changes her expression and is inhumanly stiff and artificial in many of the pictures with her and Paul VI. As she stays creepily still, with the exact same gaze and expression on her face, we will now show the source photo, then how it is cut and different backgrounds and people are inserted. The fraud is evident for all to see. The source picture for all of these cut and paste jobs from Fatima is given below in two different versions of the exact same photo is portrayed below with no one in the background. Note of course that all of this deception was released within one month of the meeting between the two. Reality is stranger than fiction. As world experts discuss the Sister Lucy truth case, here is more proof that the Fatima establishment has used doctored photos to put forward a fraud. Paul VI is actually listening to the adulating crowds who will take that enthusiasm into the new modernist revolution which he was planning. Suddenly, with this photo, Sister Lucy is no longer a prophet of doom but an enthusiastic participant in Montini's revolution. Without Photoshop. Just a little cut and paste. <laughs> 